Hello! Welcome everybody to uh, Ziggy Plays The Binding of Isaac Rebirth. Got Platinum God, that's me. We're gonna go ahead and just do a new run. So, we haven't beaten anything as anybody yet. Um, except for Greed Mode here, obviously. So there's... Why don't we have... We don't have Dark Room beaten for anything. It's kind of bizarre. Except for Judas and Isaac, okay. That's definitely not true, by the way. Alright, well, we're gonna go ahead and play as... I don't know, let's just hit the random button. Hope for not the lost. You know what? An Eve run is okay. Not my favorite, but we'll... Oh, we're still on greed mode. I'm actually gonna exit game. I'm sorry, everybody who thought we were gonna do a, a, a greed run. We're just doing hard mode. Okay, for reals this time. And uh, we gotta take a look at the seed. Don't let me forget to look at the seed. Hey, we're Isaac. That's okay. Nothing wrong with Isaac. Alright. Curse the Lost. Burning Basement. Alright, our seed is XPFNX292. Don't let me forget that so I can write it in the description. Alright. Let's do it. Um, I basically came home today. I still have a bunch of work to do tonight, but I was like, yo. I only played a little bit of <laughs> Afterbirth this afternoon when it dropped this morning and afternoon. And I really want to play more, so here we are, playing more of it. Um, hopefully you guys enjoy it. Hopefully it's not just me. These poop monsters, man. Gross. But the corn flies aren't that hard. Or at least I haven't noticed they're difficult. Maybe they're more difficult when they're in groups. Um, I'm trying to figure out what the difference is between burning basement and regular basement. And all I can really tell is sometimes you get flaming bad guys. I, I don't know if those butthole monsters are, you know tied directly to the basement. We'll have to check that out, whether or not it's the burning basement or what. We'll see. Other than that, I noticed that we have uh, flaming enemies who, when they walk in the fire, don't really take damage, like these guys right here. Normally, if they touched fire, they just die. Um, other than that, they don't seem that much different. We have a tinted rock over here. Blow it up! Spirit heart. Cool. So we'll grab that on the way out. Oh my god. Well, I think we have to, right? Gotta take the D100, we'll reroll the D6. What the hell is that? Explosivo? Sticky bomb shot? Okay, this is a new item for me. I have no idea what it does. We shall see. Don't let me forget that spirit heart. Whatever you do, don't let me forget the spirit heart. We're rolling D100 on this run. Which should be very interesting. What? That was actually pretty sweet. Oh my god. This item is so sick. I don't know if I want to reroll it. It's actually like super badass. Um, I don't know. Will you guys be upset if I rerolled this run? I kind of like the item that we have. I think we're not gonna reroll. Uh, this was just a good enough starting item. I think interesting enough that I want to keep it and see how it synergizes with other things. Um, I want to notice. I wonder how it is with, like, with soy milk or something, right? Where we're firing a million shots per second and, like, probably every five or six of those. I actually don't know how many it is. Maybe we're just getting lucky. Seems like maybe, like, a one in ten chance or something that they are exploding shots. Also, I'm taking some really bad damage, so be careful here. But it is really sweet. And they seem to go out if they, uh... If they, if the person who, the host, the host monster dies. Okay, so none of these are secret rooms, I don't think. Oh my god. Okay, let's not die on the first floor. Let's make that our pack, even if I have to go get that spirit heart first. The spirit heart's way behind there, too. So I think we might do that anyway. We'll go, uh, we'll go back and get the spirit heart. Just gonna watch him explode. That is super satisfying. Um, I think there might have been some red hearts back here, too. I don't know. Not not good play right now. That's okay. It's my first run since I got home. I don't expect to be amazing. Maybe you guys do, but... I still need practice, man. It just came out. I uh, took a pretty big hiatus from... Not a big hiatus, but I wasn't playing Rebirth as much as I used to be, so... We're getting back in the saddle for Afterbirth here. Alright. So the time is always up. Along with the counter. 
Gotcha. Or, uh, the, the score counter, my bad. Okay, we'll just leave that guy be. He's gonna die in a second. It seems to do, like, regular bomb amounts of damage. Which is pretty awesome. Huh, alright, so what are my goals for this? I don't know, I've heard that there's a secret boss that I've yet to fight. Which would be cool. Um, I don't know if there's, like, another ending boss beyond Blue Baby, because I haven't gotten there. Silas said that he beat Blue Baby and nothing happened, so... Maybe you have to beat... Oh my god. Maybe you have to beat, uh... Oh god, the Mega Satan? Yeah, maybe you have to beat Mega Satan to get to there? I have no idea. So we'll see. But I don't really want to re-roll this item, because I like it a lot. Oh, please blow up your haunts. Nah, not quite. This item seems, like, super strong. If it hits. It's a caveat to that. Oh, please don't. Yeah, blow yourself up! Oh, it's so strong. Get wrecked, haunt. Oh, it stops him in his tracks. It's so powerful. I love it. And it happens fairly often. I think that'll kill him. Yeah. All right, no problem. We'll take blue cap. The tears up is super nice. We're more likely to drop those bomb shots. That was like, did we get an item room? We totally did. Okay, we're fine. Let's move on to the next floor. It's the burning basement again. Num, 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 num. Oh, Jesus. Oh, there's a razor blade. It's Halloween, kids. Be careful. Don't eat any razor blades, please. At least I think it'll be Halloween when this goes up. I'll probably post this on Halloween. Maybe one more. Depends on how long this one takes to upload. Oh, God. What have I done? Oh, jeez. I don't know. I guess the tears themselves don't actually do damage when they land. We want to keep the spirit heart. That was a... Really lucky gold chest. We want to keep this spirit heart for the boss fight, so we don't uh, take red heart damage. So I want to get a deal with the devil. I'm sure there are more deals with the devil items that I have not seen. We have seen empty vessel. Uh, empty vessel seems to give us like flying and occasional invincibility uh, when we have no red hearts. But who knows? Uh, five cents, I think, is totally worth it. We can check for the secret room here. Second secret room. There you go. Cool. Uh, it's just a... <laughs> it's poop in the middle of some spikes. The poop contains nothing of value, so... It seems to do alright. Okay, there was a... Oh, no! I think there's a tinted rock back there. After I killed this room, I was gonna go back and get it, but, uh... You know, all is not lost. Ooh, I like these ones, too. Okay. I have to get out of here. Reset their shot counter or whatever it is. Stand over here. Sweet. So, if we take no red heart damage during the boss fight, there's still a decent chance that we get to deal with the devil. We'll see. Double monstro. Hey, buddy. How you doing? Whoa. It's been a crazy day. Hmm. Do they reset every time he jumps? Oh, it totally just murdered his ass. That was so good. It's such a good item, but I think it resets every time he jumps. So it does have its downsides. We did not get to deal with the devil. Let's go find our uh, item room. What are we hoping for? Tears upgrades are cool. I don't think I want like a brimstone or anything like that. I just think tears upgrades right now are our best friend. We can do this for free. We can do this for free. Get all this shenaniganery down and around here. All right. Coins. Oh, we have enough money to go to the shop. What do you know? Cool. So we'll do that too. <laughs> All these fortunate things are happening. It's a good start. Um, that must have been the second secret room over there, right? So I feel really bad about the damage we're taking, but it is what it is. Can't stop it. I could stop it, but I'm just bad. Headless baby is a wel welcome addition. <laughs> All right, just ignore that. Pretend it never happened. We have plenty of red hearts. We don't have any spirit hearts left to lose. Oh, Jesus! This is a late game enemy right here. This is like shoal enemies, I think. I only know this because we saw him in the greed mode. They, When they teleport, they lose the bomb. You bastard. Don't teleport. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, so highly mobile enemies are going to be a, a problem for us. I think. 
Cool. So there's our secret room. And it contains some more money, which is okay. Nothing wrong with it. You know, it's not blowing the doors off of this run, but it is what it is. We'll live. Okay, let's go see what we get from the item room. See if we can, or the shop, see if we can get anything new. We haven't seen, I haven't seen this as a scalpel? Vertical razor. Short cutter. Also, humbling bundle. What is this? What in the heck? Oh! It's the portal! It's the portal gun! That's actually pretty sweet. I like that a lot. Awesome. Because we didn't need a spacebar item. I'm totally okay with this. And this could get, out, get us out of some really sticky messes, too. Alright. Oh. Take a drink of my coffee over here. Even though it's 10 at night. Again, I got lots of work to do. And let's continue on. I really like this item. <laughs> it's super interesting. I wonder if we can span multiple rooms. Oh my god, it totally can. That's awesome. So I guess we'll mark here. And if we need to go back, then we'll just go back. Seems good enough. That's really badass. I love that it, it, it can go on multiple rooms. It means that we don't, our backtracking is going to be significantly decreased. Alright, so... <laughs> Jeez Louise, alright. Thank you, Curse of the Labyrinth. Took the words right out of my mouth, okay. Oh, get away. That is a dangerous monster you have going on there. Okay. What is the... Oh, I was like, what's the purpose of this button? Man, I get you. I, I know what you're speaking. Yeah, these, uh, these button traps don't stand a goddamn chance. Oh, troll bomb! Fucking son of a bitch. God damn it, Tyrone. <laughs> oh, and the boss was so close. Well, we can basically say goodbye to our, uh, deal with the devil chance. Thanks to that troll bomb. It doesn't look like we're gonna have too good of a, an opportunity to get one. Get out of here, you fat bats. I thought these guys spawned more bats, but maybe I'm thinking of a different enemy. Like, I remember them having a re or an afterbirth update where this this bat spat out other bats. He's got a lot of health, though. I'm also a terrible aim. Alright, Chubb. I've just hit Chubb with like a million... Yeah. A million bomb things. Damn, son. Destroyed. Okay, latch key. Luck up and a bunch of keys. Pretty good. Alright, let's backtrack a little bit. This is why we have this. Bam. Now if we want to get back to the boss room and get out of the level real fast, we can. No problem. I really like that item. It's a very cool item. Oh, we found the secret room on accident. That actually happens surprisingly often. A surprisingly often happens surprisingly often. I don't know what those guys do either. Hmm, so many things we have to learn. It makes me that's what I'm most excited about, I think, for for afterbirth is I hope I said afterbirth when we started this oh my brains fried anyway <laughs> it's the thing I'm most excited about for afterbirth I think is just like not knowing what everything does again you know after I played rebirth for so long I knew you know you know what all the items do and it kind of it doesn't lose it ex its excitement so much because there's so much like randomization that goes on but uh it's kind of like we're back in the honeymoon stage again which is nice you know, but what about the item? I don't want, I don't want to make people upset, but we gotta take mom's knife. Even though I think it removes our ability to blow shit up. Well, I'm sorry everyone. I ruined it. I apologize, but it fits thematically very well with our spacebar item, and that's all that matters, right? <laughs> Themed runs. Alright, mom's knife. We had, you know, sure sailing from here on out. Okay. <laughs> that was a little close for comfort. And we get some flies, which I think will do insane damage if they touch anything, so. Okay. 
That was like probably the easiest switch room that I've run into so far. What do we got in here? You know what? I'll take the deck of cards. Starter deck. Even though there are some pretty sweet new uh new pills. Um I actually don't think I need Oh the Fool, because I think we can just use our uh our spacebar item if we ever need to. Like to get out of boss rush if we wanted to. Which we could easily do. Though I'm not sure I would want to, considering I don't know what new stuff is there. If they've added anything, or the new bosses, or what. Could it be required to do boss rush to get to the second ending? Who knows, or the new ending. If there is a new ending. All of these questions, man, I don't have any answers. Not yet. Super Sloth, you're gonna get your ass handed to you. I have a knife and I'm prepared to fucking own you with it. Sliced and diced. Alright. The sun, the goat hoof. I think we've cleared basically this entire floor, so. Cool, cool. On to the next one. Maybe we'll get a variant floor. Nope. No variants on this one. That is what it is. Okay, we had like five hearts. Five red hearts. So I gotta remember that. And we didn't have any spirit hearts, so don't take damage. Especially if you want to deal with the devil at some point. So you can get your sweet mom's knife brimstone run that you've always wanted. Although I've had in Bomb's Knife Brimstone, it's not that great. And we've taken damage. Taken a whole heart of damage against these goddamn spiders. It's okay. Don't blame yourself, man. Don't blame yourself. Or, you know, completely blame yourself. But don't hurt yourself too bad over it. You know what? Tech point five. Super good. It's gonna allow us to do some extra damage while we uh, charge our knife. And what more could we ask for? Also, we've already taken red heart damage. We might as well try... The, uh, okay, so one and a half. We're gonna use this once. Oh, you know what? I could have used the uh, our new spacebar item there, the scalpel thing, vertical cut, to get in and out of that without taking damage. And for that, I'm a big dummy. That's all right. We'll, we'll, we'll learn, we'll get smarter, we'll become the champion this world needs. No problem. The blue anus thing. What is this black poop? Excuse me, sir, what does black poop do? Answer me now or forever hold your peace? Whoa, okay. What happens if I break both black? It's even darker. Why is... Th There's a champion that is literally just huge version? That's... Terrifying. Also, I hate this room. I've uh, This might be my least favorite room in all of Isaac history. Though with Mom's Knife, it's significantly easier. I don't know how I dodged that. Gods be praised! Any other rooms in here? There are. Okay. I'm not afraid of you, meat. The hitboxes seem a little off sometimes. I don't know if you guys watched the first episode, but I definitely... God damn it. That one was my fault. I definitely got killed by a... No spoilers. I got killed by a monster. And it was like, there was no hitbox for there to me get, for me to get hit by. It was like, delayed or something. It was weird. If you haven't seen that episode, you should go check it out. I appreciate it. Oh, goodness. Yeah, we, oh, there's a tinted rock down here, too. Cool. I miss my ability to blow shit up with my tears. I don't know why I gave that up, man. I apologize to everybody out there who's disappointed by my taking of Mom's Knife. Mm. The Bible is 100% not worth. Alright, cool. Well, now that we've... You know, we've uh, dis <laughs> dissolved. I wanted to say dissolved, but just solved that conundrum. Uh, we can just keep going. This looks like it could be just the secret room here. It's not. But it looked like it. It was tempting. Did Tech Point 5 just split into two? I think it might have just split into two. Does Tech Point 5 do that often? You seeing that? It looks like Tech Point 5 is splitting into two pieces. Maybe I'm crazy. Or maybe that's. It's just firing super fast? 
And it has a little bit of spread? I have no idea. Golden key. Alright, another spirit heart. Well, we have plenty of bombs. We might as well check these things for potential uh, magic mushroom. Two of clubs. Two of clubs. I'll never... I'll never get used to that. All right, the boss is Gertie. Gertie, this is I fought in this. I fought you in this room before. No problem. Cool. Easy peasy. Health upgrade. It's okay. It's not great. Let's not take any red heart damage. I think Guppy's paw might have given us enough insulation to make it through this floor. Yeah, we have three spirit hearts. Um. Yeah, I think we can do it. Three spirit hearts should be more than enough to get me through a floor like necropolis with uh you know with the, the the mom's knife took me a second there to remember what i had okay suck it horseman heads no problem we're gonna check it out sometimes pays out it's a, it's important to, to go for those these black meat men oh jesus okay we can't be taking dumb damage like that. We gotta be a little bit more careful. <laughs> be careful. Alright, so we got a bomb. Or got some bombs, which I think we'll use them to blow up skulls in this room. Mm. Oh yeah, I forgot we have we can have more than one card. It's like it's not really that good. Should I even keep it? Oh, doesn't matter. So I think I place it here, I can get all three. Oh, I was wrong. Empress, Sun, I think is better. An Empress Two Farts. We'll take it. We can't use the Blood Bank, but I wasn't planning on it anyway. We have enough money to almost make the shop worthwhile. Almost. Very close. It'd be very sad if I could have, uh... Okay. I think it's, like, right about here. Like here? Something like that? I don't think it was, yeah. It's, like, it's very doubtful that that's the secret room, but it might as well check. I mean, we haven't learned whether or not secret rooms can be offshot from the small rooms, so that'll be an important thing to, an important thing to test. I need to enunciate better. I apologize, and I will uh, do my best to get better at that. Still rather new to recording stuff in terms of uh, doing Let's Play things. Okay, fine, totally good, no worries. Tower. I do not want the tower. Wheel of Fortune, we will play twice. In hopes for a spirit heart, and then we'll blow the shit up. Should have placed it closer to uh, these skulls. In case one of them was, in fact, a, uh, a black heart. Yeah, we'll go to the. We'll hermit it. The hermit. Hmm. Hmm. See, where I'm stuck is I don't know what the, uh, the box does on this floor what was my other card the Sun card you know what we can make ourselves virtually invincible with blank card Sun card so we're gonna do it blank card Sun card it is no issues there I don't even know how much damage our tech point five is doing but I think it's quite a bit oh it's gish poops oh Jesus Get out of my house, please. Alright. I had never fought those or seen them. Silas had told me about them, though, because we were uh, we were playing the other day. The other day. It was earlier today. It feels like so long ago. Alright. Um, sun card. Where did I put the sun card? There it is. Don't want the tower. Empress. Sun card is basically like last resort slash killing a room. So we can go like this, get rid of everything, and also know where all the stuff on the floor is. And heal ourselves. It's a super good luck up. What? I must have picked up a lucky penny. Oh, because we beat greed mode, we unlock lucky pennies. I don't really know. I didn't see any physical difference because I wasn't paying attention. We'll have to keep our eye out. Uh, do I want to reroll Demon Baby? No, I think Demon Baby is a solid choice. I'm okay with keeping Demon Baby. And we can just head straight for the boss. Uh, we'll go to the secret room first, though. Who doesn't want to go to the secret room? Important to remember that this room sometimes has secret rooms adjacent to them. 
those patterns are important things to remember. I don't know if that counted as red heart damage. I hope not. Did you see that? I, I swear to God, Tech Point Five does some like strange shit sometimes. It's like sometimes it wiggles. Let's grab it. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, this guy should be no problem. Get out of here, wall spider. Ugh. So tired today. Went and saw... What did I do today? So he streamed after birth at like... Oh, Jesus. At 10 a.m. when it came out. 10.30 when it actually came out. Um, which was super exciting. And I had a lot of fun doing that. And then I went to class for like three hours. And I had to leave early because then I was going to... Um, what was it? I was going to like... Well, I just got back from it. A, uh, a Nightmare Before Christmas along with the orchestra kind of thing. Which they like... They play music alongside the movie. So the music... The movie has all the music taken out of it. And then like the orchestra plays all the music that would normally be in the movie. And it was pretty sweet. Oh, we haven't played on the Dank Depths before. This is new. Alright, we'll have to keep our eyes out. Um, the orchestra played all the music. Which is really awesome. And they did a really good job. Uh, except that I spent the whole time watching the movie instead of, uh, looking at the orchestra, because it was up there. I feel a little bad about it, but I don't know what else they expected. I'm trying to... For right now, Dank Depths just seems a lot like regular Depths. But who knows? I could be wrong. We might see some new enemy types in here. Oh, I think these poops have a chance to become... Gish Poops. Gish Poops. Number one. I think it just significantly lowers our range. It doesn't do a whole lot for us, right? Oh, and it gives us a sweet ass yellow knife, and I think it causes our tech point five to shoot more often, so maybe that wasn't a, a, a good investment. Who knows? We'll find out. Okay, tiny self sacrifice room. The music for this area is sweet as heck. God damn it. I feel like I'm way slow. I'm not really that slow, I'm actually pretty fast, but it feels like I'm slow. Alright. Let's blow these up, and these up. Hope to get a black heart, but we didn't. Okay, we got a dart, or a red chest. Uh, fingers crossed for not troll bombs. Oh, it's cards. Oh ho ho. Hero font. So we'll use one of the hero font cards, because we only not... Oh no, I used both! Well, that was my bad. I meant to press R. I pressed right bumper. I'm using a controller, by the way. Um, but we have max spirit hearts. So, this might be the the, the floor where we get the, uh, the deal with the devil. Which is just in time. Just before we take our trip. And I think we're going to go ahead and go with the dark room this time. Just because... Just because, uh, it feels like a better idea to do that than while we're, while we're strong, basically, than to go with the Angel uh, Isaac fight. Although, who knows? You know. We'll see. I like my piss knife. Alright. I think that guy counts as damage, so we don't want to actually use him. Even though he could give us a deal with the devil item, it's most likely growth hormones. <laughs> Which isn't a deal with the devil item, but he tends to give out syringes. Alright, I think we can just blow this up. Yeah, no problem. Chaos! Okay, Chaos card Empress. Uh, heck yes. <laughs> Game over, dog. Okay, that's what we want. Why is this guy huge? He's huge and slow. It would be intimidating if he didn't die just as fast to my knife, but... There's no stopping that. Alright. Whoa! Cool. But yeah, now we have... Fucking blank card, chaos card. Which is like... The ultimate. Destroy everything. Doesn't even matter. Um... There's a half-decent chance that we get 
if we can get a deal with the angel on this floor, then we can possibly fight Mega Satan on this run, and it would be easy as hell. But, flip side of that, that was a lucky penny, I didn't even look. I have a problem with just picking up pennies. Um, picking up pennies. Mom. Okay. I'm still going really slow, which is, uh, not to do with the items that we have, because the items we have are probably going to facilitate us destroying this run. But it is more along the- why am I doing this instead of Chaos Card? Who knows? Oh, um, we're going to go Dark Room. we got to deal with the Devil. And it's Razor Blade. Which we will leave right there. Um, we're going hella slow, and that's hecka slow. We're going super slow. And that's probably more to do with the fact that I'm just rusty and not great. Um, but it is what it is. We'll live. Whoop. Destroyed. Cool. Up we go. Ah, god damn it. Well, champions are no different than regular people now. I think that was not a champion, but... Less to fear, you know. Less to be afraid of. Suck it. Suck it. Duke of Flies doesn't stand a goddamn chance. Alright. Let's just find our way out of here as fast as possible. We can do this! Forgot about that. Okay. So it looks like we want to go this direction. Yeah. Oh, I can use it to find secret rooms too. Man, I forgot how good blank card, sun card is. But it's probably going to grant us mostly invincibility for the rest of this game. Which is awesome. That's not bad at all. Mom's knife hitbox, man. Gets me sometimes. How much health do you have? Thank you. Alright. Okay. Oh, I should be on the lookout for single pennies. Because those are lucky pennies. Because we have, um, what's it called? Dump humbling bundle? Yeah, we have humbling bundle. So all of our consumables should be doubled, but I think the, the lucky pennies come in only singles. So if we look for just a single penny, that is definitely a uh, lucky penny. God damn it. Not what I meant to do. I meant to use the sun card to blow him. Oh, I didn't get a chance to look at it. It just spawned on top of me. Gosh darn it. My world is so difficult. Okay, I'm not doing so well. We just need to calm down. Take some deep breaths. We'll be fine. Uh, yeah, we'll take it. No problem taking it. Secret room contains... Skinny odd mushroom surrounded by a bunch of greeds. You just get this by dropping a bomb, can't you? I mean, I think it lowers our damage and it doesn't necessarily do anything for us, but it makes us tiny, which is adorable. Just blow them all up. Fuck you guys! Oh, what? Book of Secrets, which let us know where the second secret room was. Guys, I'm the best. Alright, and we're also slightly faster, which is nice. Make dodging easier. Okay, let's get some spirit hearts. Spirit hearts! At this point, Ace of Spades might be better. No, I think Goat Hoof's better. We, I think we're set on cards, to be fair. Alright, well, it is what it is. Okay, let's fight our boss. Get a Chaos card ready for him. Ooh, consumable sack contains two of diamonds, two of diamonds. and another sun card, right? Oh, double chaos card, which we don't really want, so. It, it flew the wrong direction, I aimed it up. God damn it, bloat. Piece of poop. What is this? Mr. Dolly, range and tears up and one of each kind of heart. That's cute. Um, 
We have a little Maggie doll now. Well, I was, should have used that, but whatever. It's okay. <laughs> we've gotten no deals with the devil, but it doesn't matter. Even though I'm terrible, we've had a tremendous amount of luck, so... No worries. Oh, God. This is a heinous button room. What? God damn it. Alright. Two rooms we'll be able to figure out which way we're going. We'll heal ourselves back to max HP. We'll be fine. No one's dying this run. We're gonna be okay. If I die this run, you can make fun of me for all of eternity. What the No, please oh, okay. The sun. Yeah, we get another charge for it. Okay, either way we're going through big rooms. So we're gonna go through this big room instead. Polycephalus, get out of here. Stop crying on me. I will say, Polycephalus' advanced boss, like his death, dead version of him, is like, way harder. <laughs> like, significantly more difficult. I might consider the hardest boss in the game right now. So what I'm gonna do here, so go in here, open this up, it's Troll Bomb, come out, Sun Card, we'll be fine. It's a room full of lusts. Oh my god. Thanks, buddy. Okay. We could be doing better. Suicide King, let's not. Let's not and say we did. Unless we pick up, like, nine lives or something, but I don't know why I would pick up nine lives at this point. We have so much money, I would love at least, like, one Spirit Heart. We have plenty of luck ups from Lucky Pennies. Small rock is pretty dope, but what, that's what I wanted. Just give me spirit hearts. Okay, we'll go until we're 80 cents. Okay, we're at 80 cents. We're fine. We'll blow up the, uh... Okay, that wasn't it. We'll blow up this one, then. Bam! You have to blow up all of them? Just want one red heart. Oh, you're gonna give me four keys instead? Alright. I'll accept your payment. Okay, I was looking for tinted rocks. But none of these are tinted rocks. I have to be really careful in the womb. are very reliable to miss them. Yeah, get killed by your own spider friend. Okay, we'll check our secret room, and we can basically use this to avoid half the floor. And go ahead and fight whatever mini-boss it is. I don't know what mini-boss I'd want, but... No, oh, Gluttony's okay. I don't think that we can get to his HP unless he gets to the corner. Come here. Oh, If he's in the corner, he can sometimes drop it. Like, outside his little box. His little shame box. Oh my god, that's the biggest gurgling of all time. Don't, don't make your adult gurgling sounds at me. That's a, a full gurg. Rawr. That was weird. Did you hear, like, it was just, like, the regular voice actor. The girl who does all the voice acting. For, like, the Isaac-sized characters. I just don't know how it happened. Oh! Uh, no! Stop! Fiend! Alright. Apparently, it wasn't enough to hit that guy. Oh, God! Okay, we have the sun card. That was a very tiny one. It was kind of cute. Okay, chaos card. What? It flies in such a random direction! Is it is it purposely flying in a random direction? Okay, I didn't want to die. So I used my sun card. It's not the direction I was aiming. But it's very possible that the chaos card just goes whichever direction it wants to. What? Did you spawn something up there? Oh, I think we're gonna die. That's really awkward. I just died to a spider on the fucking mom fight. Well, everybody. 
I'm sorry that run was going so well and I goofed it, but again, I'm trying to learn, I'm getting better, and uh, I hope to see you guys on the next episode. Alright guys, see ya.